Hey guys, this is David from Benchmark. Today I have the Matrice 350 RTK drone, two payloads for it, and the intelligent battery station behind me. We got the M350 right here, the intelligent battery station, and the L2 in its own little case right here. We're gonna go through all three of these boxes, see what's included, and then what it looks like when you buy one. Hey, the first box we got here is the L2 LiDAR scanner. That's the, the LiDAR payload for these things, the latest and greatest. This thing can get you four centimeters on the ground from 150 meters in the air. It's actually really good. If I just open this box up here, nice little hard case. Here's the L2. Here it is. Pull it out. It's on its gimbal here. It's got a nice little lens cap. If you pull that off. See another sticker stopping you from just uh, getting your fingerprints all over it before you get using it. Okay, we got a cleaning cloth right here in case you do get fingerprints all over the screen. Comes with a manual on how to use it. And as you can see in the case here, it's got some instructions on how to store it. So you always wanna store it mirror side up. Uh, you don't wanna put the mirror down on the foam just in case any dirt gets in the case or something like that. You don't wanna get that scratched up. Let's move on to the next one. This right here is the Intelligent Battery Station, the battery charger for short. Uh, you open this thing up, it can store up to eight batteries at the same time and also some batteries for the controller here. It comes with all your wall plugs, some USB plugs as well for these USB ports here. Plug this guy into the wall, throw a few batteries in, it'll keep them charged. It can do storage mode where it keeps them at 50%, ready to fly mode where it'll keep them all at 90%, uh, and then uh, you know a good to go field mode where it'll just charge them all up. You can plug the controllers straight into these USB ports if you wanted to. Uh, or you can charge the batteries along this line right here. Uh, super easy to use and really handy to take places if you need to move it between offices or you need to take it to a field location. Last but not least, we got the fun box here. The actual DJI Matrice M350 RTK drone. Let's open this case up here. Pop it open right in the middle of the case. You can see we got the DJI M350. This is the heavy lifter if you're doing LiDAR or you're doing serious photogrammetry work. This is the guy you're gonna need. Uh, we got the landing gear up here. Uh, not attached yet. We can put that on in a second. Uh, it comes with all your all your cleaning products back here. The controller right here. Uh, we'll fold out antennas, fits right in the case. Nice and easy to use. Uh, you can see it even comes with a little diagram of how to plug it into the charging station. And then over here, we have our H30T camera. Now this is what guys have been using to do photogrammetry and thermal work. Just pop the, uh, the lens cap off here. You can see it's got all five camera modules on here. It's got the wide angle, it's got the zoom, it's got the range finder, NIR auxiliary light camera, and it also has that thermal camera because it's the T option. Right in between those, we got the, the manual for the H30 here. Uh, the H30 series, so it's both the H30 and the H30T. And then if we pop this guy out, so we'll take these, these guards out. I'm gonna take these landing craft out and uh, get them attached here. Yeah, I got the landing gear on here, so I can just pull the drone out like that, and then I can pretty easily just turn it around and stand it up on my table. Now, underneath the drone, in these two compartments, we got our two intelligent batteries right here. Now, you need two of these guys in the drone to fly it. You hit the button, it'll tell you how charged it is. Mine's not very charged right now. But you put these in, and then uh, you'd be able to work with this thing. Fire this guy up real quick. All right, so this is it, the DJI M350 RTK. We got the L2 LiDAR payload and the H30 photogrammetry payload uh, with the thermal option there as well. If you're looking for more details, if you got a use case for these drones, lots of guys are doing topos, lots of guys are doing LiDAR scans with this sort of thing. Uh, if you're looking for more details, if you want to see if this is the right fit for the stuff you do, just give us a call at the number on the screen. We'd be more than happy to help you out.